Alright guys, <clears throat> looks like we are about uh, 15 minutes late. Had a little bit of uh, some technical difficulties. Don't know why, but for some reason my uh, stream key for Twitch had uh, switched it up. Robert, what's up man? Thanks for tuning in. So, a uh, little delay there. It took about 15 minutes or so to actually get, <clears throat> get logged in and get streaming. But we are going to do some alien... Uh, I've got some uh, new scenes put together so I can switch back and forth between two different two camera setups so you can see me if anybody would ever want that and then you can also see uh, the large LCD screen in the back box and I have tried to get it to focus on that as much as possible hopefully you guys will be able to make things out on there uh, otherwise we're just going to do some play here so at the start of the game you can either have the left flipper hit which will start you with the alien mode <coughs> mode sorry there's five of them or you can hit the right flipper and start with aliens uh, tune the volume on the game up a little bit here and uh, hopefully you guys can hear me and the game also I don't know how the audio is doing with delay yet or anything so if there's issues let me know and I'll make adjustments there. Joel, I did not see the video yet. Thanks for tuning in, by the way. Uh, I just happened to catch a quick picture of it that somebody messaged me right before I went live. But what I saw did look pretty cool. I heard Auric did not do the art, which is kind of interesting. But hey, whatever. Hopefully... That, honestly, the most annoying thing has been, dang it, the uh, <clears throat> thread on pin side. CNK, what's up? Audio is way ahead. We got you. Continue mission. All right, I just added on a one second delay. Let me know how that goes. Uh, but yeah, the picture I saw looks good. And as much as possible, please keep me uh, getting feedback on the ball save. No ball save, terrible. On the uh, delay. I'm just going to do some flipper hits here so you guys can kind of get an idea. Let me know if that's making a difference at all. Terrible game I got going anyway. Holy cow. So I'll go grab my headphones and plug into my phone here and test it out myself as well. That was me not paying attention. Still audio pretty far ahead. Okay, thank you. Mess with it here some more. Not bad for it. Get my headphones. Another second of delay. We can try that too. <clears throat> it was working so well last multiple scenes put together, so that could be causing it. Wouldn't surprise me. Anyway, uh, thank you guys for tuning in so far. Still messing with it. And if it continues, I'll just take off this second scene with the player camera. That might be where the issue's at. Ripley, we have to talk. Should be at a full two second delay now. Move it on! Skill shot awarded.
Hey, Mac, what's up, man? Going down. So, I started APC mode, and basically I want to hit the blue shots, hopefully those are showing up on the play field okay. I saw somebody post earlier about how this game didn't have any flow, and I think they're crazy. Problems. Zentron, how's it going, man? The game looks good, thank you. Uh, it survived going up to Pinball at the Zoo. We got 350 plays. Audio any closer, guys? Hopefully, getting closer to sync. Uh, Zentron, I did not see the LE video. I saw a quick screen grab, screen grab of the artwork for the back glass. It looked really good. So that's all I've seen. I'm gonna turn down. I feel like I'm shouting. I don't know how it is for you guys. I want you guys to be able to hear the game, but I don't want to, like, scream at you. Hand-drawn back glass. That's cool. Uh, I do want to check it out. I'm definitely going to check it out later tonight. Alright. We'll go with Alien. And from what I can tell is it starts every other game, Alien, and then Aliens. But you do have the ability to change it yourself. Between the two different modes. So we'll do alien right here. Far left saucer there is your mystery award. It's also a vent shot. You can also collect a face hugger there. More importantly, it sets up a very important shot, the chest buster. Which is really only hittable from that upper flipper on the left side. And it is hard as hell to hit. There it is. As I say, it's only hittable from the upper. So right now, all right, there we go. I just shot the queen in the middle. And you should be seeing on the display an animation for what they call a life cycle. So the life cycle goes egg, face hugger, chest buster, and then lastly, the queen or xenomorph shot up the middle uh, megalo I was not streaming I was actually yeah, I was Good. testing some stuff um, it, and I don't even honestly know if it's working but uh, if any of you are not subscribers or followers which I'm guessing you are since you're here watching and you hit that an animation should pop up on my screen now uh, I have the keys, Joel. The latest code has still not been released publicly, and it stinks because Joe just keeps messaging us, telling us, like, all this new stuff that's going into it, and it's like, oh, I want that, and it's the reason I haven't put the game on location yet. So we started another mode. This is Derelict Ship, 
which I just beat for the first time last night. I'm shooting the orbits. The blue one increases the value. But a couple orbit shots and then a clean shot. Once you shoot the orbit, you really need to kind of rattle around the pops a bit. And I did not get that. Uh, Joel, audio is behind the video. Is that correct? Uh, if so, let me know and I'll try going up to two and a half seconds. Ant, it's always just you, man. I think. Yes, that is the main head you are looking at. Uh, right now, actually, and not the Playfield LCD. Uh, as you can kind of tell, there's a slight delay between my big LCD and the actual Playfield camera. Ooh, that was close. Alright, this mode is Tunnel Hunt. The GI dies in Tunnel Hunt, so hopefully you guys can still make out the play field okay. Oh, because I'm just going to drain anyway. Oh, hopefully that ball's safe. Good. Oh, there we go. So I got to go Vent 1, which is far left saucer. Oh, and I also just lit a multi ball. So if I shoot vent one right now, I'm gonna start sentry on multi ball, and that's turning into a big if. There it is. All right, sentry gun is going. Gun, which did not last long. The orbits were the jackpots. There's both vent shots. So now I just need to shoot the scoop to beat it. Oh. jack the legs up a bit since I came home. Alright, that means we actually beat a mode. Which is nice. Now if I can catch the ball here. Okay. So, as you look on the large LCD screen, you see the shotgun. Which is the Ithaca 37 shotgun. I'm sure you can't make those fonts out. Uh, and it's a launch, it says press launch button for two xenomorph hits. These are what are called power ups. So you earn the weapons, you can use the power up. Now the big one with this is if I'm close to the uh, multi ball start for the xenomorph, uh, then my ball's draining and I hit power up and I basically get a free ball save. So I'm gonna hit it right now anyway and just use up those hits. There we go. And now it's back to left ramp, right ramp, that should light my mode start. Start another mode. Uh, yes, CNK, the flippers are green. That's how they came on mine. Stop. Alright, so what I will do if I get a second to do it here. I'm trying to trap up right now. Alright. So basically, find Jonesy is you want to wait until the orange shot lights and then shoot it. And right now, it's the upper left ramp, which is almost impossible to hit anyway. And time ran out. I did not find Jonesy. So let's go for acid burn. I 
love that feed. Even though it's fast and can be dangerous. Pinrolls we'll see later. Ant has sound. Kangaroos put the, the satellite dish for the internet back. That's good. Nice little backhand into the airlock. That thing's gonna eat through the goddamn hall. Come on. This is starting acid burn. As you will be able to see on the LCD screen, it says search all decks. That is blue arrows. And they give you a point value that is counting down. And then it gives you green arrows that you do not want to shoot. Uh, I got a smart gun. I'm going to hit that. It gave me a lock this time. And oh no. Drained right down the middle. Post. Uh, the lighting on this game, CNK, is just, like, awesome. Uh, big, big fan. Really impressed with it. Uh, I could see it struggling in some locations. Because there's at least two modes where the GI, like, dies. And you just have your couple shots you need to hit that are lit. In home environment, no big deal. And I've got lighting set up for the stream. But, uh, yeah, I, I can see that in a bar being an issue. Uh, you guys want to see Alien or Aliens on this one? Let me know. Ripley, we have to talk. Aliens are the blue modes on the right. So Left side is Alien. Down. Modes are different. Lost with the but yet, yeah, awesome. Zentron, you heard correctly. The uh, things that go bump in the night, spooky the pinball documentary is awesome. Ooh, can maybe hear a little thunder outside. I'm just gonna kill this whole scene, guys, with the extra camera and see if that helps with the audio. So that should have taken one camera off. Uh, CNK, the head still does not work. I still have a prototype board in my game, actually, that controls that. Um, what happened was the tongue was coming out too frequently, and it could be hit. So, therefore, they disabled it. And, uh, so it's disabled right now. Uh, they just unplugged the board. If I were to cut the wire that controls the tongue... Uh, the Xenomorph jaw actually moves as you hit it, like it's yelling at you. But you guys wouldn't be able to see it on the stream anyway, so I haven't really done anything with that. Oh, cool, man. I'm glad that they did mention that. Uh, what did they mention? <laughs> I was told it could possibly be shipping out this week for me, so that's what I had heard. Um... Give me some audio feedback here. I'm just going to hit the flippers while I'm quiet and see how well it's synced. I'm guessing that I killed that camera and it may be like ready to go now, so we'll see here. He has intercepted the transmission of unknown origin. This is a commercial ship, not a rescue ship. Let me know how close that was to being in sync and what sort of adjustment I need to make. I'm going to get started here. Go left ramp, right ramp, start a mode. Right on with the sink. All right. Thanks, Joel. Appreciate it, man. All right. This is, again, find Jonesy. Catch a ball, cradle up, hit the orange shots. So right orbit. Oh, I hit it, actually. And. Upper ramp is no good. Uh, oh, airlock, airlock. Okay, that's good. Airlock means we're at the end. Oh, that's a virtual ball save. Still at the airlock. Now that right there is a code issue. Where ball save just kicked out two balls, so I drained one. That is fixed on the code update, I've been told. And that's going to be a failure, because I missed it again. Oh, thought the center post was going to save me. All right, guys, thanks for the audio feedback. I greatly appreciate that. Jump right back in here. Left ramp, right ramp, mode. 
you just saw that. That was the upper left flipper to the upper right ramp. I love that shot. Tunnel escape. You should see far left side, the one will be lit. And then Give us a chance. The three is right there. That's the three. You don't have to hit them in order. I don't know if there's different points for doing it in order. Oh, that usually sticks. There's an upper left ramp for you. Again, whoever said this game doesn't flow. I don't know what they were doing. Ah, man. Another upper left. Oh, it felt good. Alright, that started centering on multi ball and collected our vent one. So we should be able to go to the scoop to complete the mode. And we can shoot the orbits, the jackpots. And they eventually light the queen as well as the scoop for jackpots. So that's the mode completion. That's going to be add a ball at the mystery award. Joel, the uh, Xeno head will not grab the ball. I am waiting on the production board. So this is Sentry Gun Multi Ball, and this is the one you will see the most. Most likely, when playing an alien. Uh, I was told that they are debating actually making this harder to get because it does occur so frequently right now. And it is the only mode, only multi-ball mode, that you can actually stack with another one, with another multi-ball. Um, it seems, just from what I can tell, most of the multi-balls are stackable with modes, but you actually have some modes you don't want to do that. Yeah, the no flow thing, I, I saw somebody post that, and I was like, I don't know what you're talking about, but uh, the shots are not easy. I will give them that. Uh, that that part I will admit. So it takes a little while to get in, get in ugh, into your shots. We got two modes done over here. You don't have to beat the modes to actually advance, which is nice. Left ramp, there's our right ramp. Oh, just in and out. Uh, every time you shoot the left ramp, you add a letter to the word drop. And every time you shoot the right ramp, you add a letter to the word ship. And when you spell drop ship, it doubles your scoring for like 20 seconds, I believe. Which is very nice. Just happened to me like three or four times. Not bad for a human. Mixer Tuna. What's up, man? Thanks for tuning in. Oh, wow, there's a lot of you here. Awesome, guys. Matt, what's up? Didn't even see some of you. Uh, we'll go again here. We'll do aliens so you guys can check out some of the blue modes or the aliens modes. Going down. I 
I still have not yet figured out. There we go. There is a little yellow insert right here that says recharge. That is with a stand-up target. I still have not figured out what that one does. Oh, that was terrible. to the upper left scoop. I collected a weapon. I'm going to use that here. Uh, shoot eggs to torch them. So I need to get it up into the pops. And I don't know how well it shows up. Now I got to shoot the queen. Still shoot the queen. There she is again. Shoot the queen to attack her. There she is again. Oh man. And I failed. All you failed means is that you did not complete the mission in time. Collect another weapon here. Come on, hyper sleep. Oh. I don't know what our weapon did, but it did not save us. Not bad for a human. Jump back to Alien. I'll try to get through these modes. You guys can see the mini wizard mode. Okay, it gave me a weapon right off the start, which is nice. The drop targets over here at the lower left, or left, sorry, lower right side of the play field, of which I just cleared. Those light the Hyper sleep lock, which is your upper left ramp. Oh, which I just missed. It is nice that when you miss that, typically the drain, uh, the, as it drains down, it seems to come into the right end lane. So it works out well. Alright, we are in acid burn, which is again, shoot the blue shots. And not the green shots, because they are acid. missed it, you can actually shoot early enough on the upper right flipper to hit the upper right ramp sometimes. It's ridiculous, but it's seriously possible. And we beat that mode. As you can see, scores at 13 million, 11 million in that mode. So there is good points in the mode. Not just that one, but all of them, really. Alright, so I now have two weapons. Three weapons, actually. So my first one is going to advance my bonus X. So it should go from... It's in the playfield LCD screen. Uh, just above it, the answer is let us tune out. It should go to four. So that's up to four. 
I have the shotgun, which will give me two Xenomorph hits. We're going to use that. And now I have Smart Collect. We're going to wait on Smart Collect to use. Uh, just in case I get to the point where I need a ball save or something. And that gives it to me. Oh. Go. What the hell are you doing, man? Yeah, the modes are uh, fun, actually. I don't know if that's normal, good, bad, and different, but I like it. Well, shit. Orange is apparently staying on the right orbit. And then it changed to blue, so I don't know if I got that or not. Smart shot gave me a lock. 23 million on ball one is not bad though. Well Ship, which again I beat for the first time last night I was able to pull the audits off the game and it shows you like how many times you've started each mode how many times you completed each mode Playfield going right now. And oh, robbed. Oh, back down. It's going to be out of control. God, upper left ramp feels so nice to hit. That's going to be Ambush Multi-Ball. This is the Xenomorph Alien Head one. And I believe your jackpots are actually like the different flashing colored inserts in this one. So the scoop right there, right now the uh, right orbit, back to the scoop. And oh, I didn't even see that one, but the saucer. Most of them have like multiple targets going for it. And right now, the shot is the 
a virtual ball save. Oh, there we go. Let's get over to Tunnel Hunt here. cycle if you missed me explaining earlier it goes there's two inserts it's the orbits that are the eggs the three vent shots are your face huggers then the chest buster is the stand-up target behind the right ramp and then you shoot the queen in the middle you have to complete three of those to light the save newt multi-ball but I was also told that completing those Increases the scoring for all the modes, like every time you do a life cycle. The most I have completed is three. This is self destruct. This is the alien mini wizard mode. Oh, get up there. Oh, come on. Oh, rattling in. Oh, we did not complete it. I'm sorry. Multi-ball lit again at the left. I have not completed a single life cycle in this game. A lot of times this pop bumper will kind of give you a cheap hit up there. It is not this game. Okay. Oh man. 
I have only gotten one extra ball myself. Oh, come on. There it is. Alright. This is Queen's Nest. We are on to the Aliens modes. We've played three of the multi-balls. We're not even close to the fourth one, though. Shoot eggs to torch them. Get it up there. That left orbit is definitely easier to hit than the right. In case you couldn't tell. Oh, no. All right, we got ball save, so I'm not going to dick with it. Oh, man. I'm trying to let one of those drain. There we go. I don't think that's good enough to get on the board. Not bad for a human. But not bad for a human. Alright, give me one sec. I gotta grab a phone charger. I shall return. Yeah, 116 was pretty nice. Not great. Pretty nice. We will start with uh, aliens this time. Now I got all fired up. I'm going to do at least one more here. Wow, that was a, that was a live catch right there. going to drain. We are going to drain. That is what we are going to do. Weapon was awarded. It's just an increased bonus multiplier. And I used it right away. Not good. 
Uh, by the way, check the audits after taking the game to the show this weekend. The average ball time was 13 seconds. Which tells me there's a lot of people that come to pinball shows that do not know how to play pinball. This don't drain. It's my favorite mode. Combat drop. It is very fun. Alright. Last game. That'll put us at like an hour almost. <laughs> I wish I was just getting warmed up. I am very tired right now. And my left slingshot is acting up a little bit, so I gotta kinda of straighten that out. Alright, we got our mission ready. I am going to attempt to get a life cycle before we actually. There's the egg. Before we actually uh, <clears throat> start a mode up, let's we'll see how much the scoring changes. And if you drain, it doesn't really do much for you, it turns out. That is down the middle, alright, finally. Judge one of those right. Holy cow. Okay, we're not gonna end on this game. This was the warm up game before the last game. Going down. Skill shot Okay, on a positive note, I think that's the third time I've correctly used the uh, center post on this game. Get up there! There it is, it got it, okay. Oh no, it didn't get it, I lied. Tell you what, I don't know if these drop targets give you anything for knocking them down, but I'm nailing those. Thank you so much. I will let you know. It's supposed to pop up on the screen, but clearly did not. So, something of what I did did not go right. But I greatly appreciate that. Oops, I started another game. We'll do one. More. Nobody wants to end on a Saturn, right?
is egg. That is face hugger. Now we gotta hit the chest buster, which is really hard to hit. Oh, I got it. Which means we then now need to hit the queen. Which did it. There we go. So now you should see the life cycle animation play. Should we go for a second life cycle? I vote yes. ZZ Top, you know nothing about this game. Sorry, I'm trying to look at my chat. I got my phone plugged in. Let me fix my screen here so I can see it. Oh, that's the wrong way. That took the chat away. I gotta fix it here. Woo! There we go. Zentron, you do not want me to do your algebra. Uh, ZZ Top. So you got two different left ramps, okay? Both feed the left inlane, which lights Waylon. You have a right ramp, which feeds the right inlane. Uh, that gives you Utani. Both of those will light the scoop at the back, the airlock, to start your modes. At the beginning of the game, you choose either Alien with your left flipper, or Aliens with your right flipper. I picked Alien, the green one, that's why it's flashing. That is your basic mode functionality. Uh, I am attempting to complete life cycles. We have done one. You start as an egg, which is either of the orbit shots. You then need a face hugger, which is a vent shot, the far left scoop, the upper inner orbit, orbit which is vent three, or Hadley's Hope vent two, uh, the reverse inlane, I think it's called. I don't really know. It's cool. And that will give you a face hugger. You need to finish that off with a chest buster. You know what? Let's, let's get fancy, guys. Boom. Look at the play field here, okay? Your chest buster is right there. Okay, it is the stand-up target that is lit just underneath the right pop bumper. That's your chest buster, and you finish off your life cycle by shooting the queen directly in the middle of the play field. Two stand-up targets underneath there. All right, life cycles, you need to complete three of those, so 12 shots to light save newt multi-ball. Uh, also, I have been told, I cannot confirm, but I do believe, that... Completing life cycles makes the modes, multi-balls, etc. worth more points. That is why we are attempting it. Holy cow, was that anticlimactic. Hugger and a drain. Wow. And we got to do one more, right? Yeah, let's do one more. I'm going to attempt the same thing of getting at least one, maybe two life cycles complete before we 
trying to start a mode. And there's one of them. Uh, hard to say what my favorite shot is, the upper left ramp or that right ramp. The right ramp's fairly easy, honestly, but it feels really good. It's a turnaround ramp, and I just really like those, to be honest with you. All right, hypersleep lock that I just qualified is the upper left ramp, which will start hypersleep multi-ball. All right, there's our second face hugger. We are now going for Mr. Chestbuster over there. Oh man, it's a little too slow. Um, god damn. Uh, Mac, I'm still really liking Alien right now. Uh, we are actually recording the podcast tomorrow, and we'll talk about that. But yes, I, I'm happy with my purchase as of right now. There's a lock for you. And, uh, it's happy to see that they did finally show some of the LE artwork today. Honestly, just so people on Pinside shut up. It's been, uh, really vocal in the owner group or the pre order group. Uh oh. There it is. Alright, we got our second chest buster. Oh, we started a mode instead of hitting the queen. I think we can still hit the queen in the mode. This mode, you actually gotta shoot the blue stand ups that are flashing. It's my favorite mode. Oh, that was close. You need to shoot enough to load the ship for the combat drop. And then once they are loaded, you shoot the ramps. Specifically the... Oh! Oh, there's another lock. Oh, it's gonna start my multi-ball. Good thing it did because if not, I was in some trouble. I do have a second multi ball lit right now. I don't know if that started soon enough or not. That they're going to be stacked. They are. So basically hitting that shot served as a really big uh, ball save. Just got timed it just right. This is one area where the game is currently lacking. Is the call out for jackpots and such. Really have to pay attention to the screen to know you're getting them. Ooh, I got double values with two multi-ball stacks. Potential for a big score. That was actually a left out lane virtual ball save. That's what brought that ball back. In case you're like, how do you just get all those balls back? There's gonna be another one right there.
Okay, the good news is I only have one more life cycle to save new. Oh! And it gave me the chest buster. I should have saved that for... Oh, they gave me the face hugger. I should have saved it for the chest buster. That was dumb on my part. Let's hope for some good pop action. We got none. Which... Oh, get up there! It does happen fairly often still. They are updating that in the code as well. How the pop bumpers actually register. Get up. Ah, oh, man. to see if they're more valuable with life cycles. All right, what are we shooting here? Shoot left ramp or orbit. All right, right now my left ramp light does not seem to be working. I don't know if that's connector. I've been shaking the game pretty hard. So that could be a lot of things I imagine. Oh! We got problems. ZZ Top later, man. Thanks for tuning in. And that's all. Hmm. Not bad for it. I'm gonna go in here real quick and try an all lamp test. Looks like I got three out on the left side. So, hey, we might as well open her up. Glass, I hadn't noticed yet on highway. It's one piece with the frame. Very nice. Set that far away out of the way here. Six ball game, in case you were wondering. And at this point, uh, this actual machine has over a thousand plays on it already, which is quite a few in my mind. for us. still here I am just uh, experimenting you could say
Classic power down, power on doesn't work. Nothing will. seem good all right cool I'll tell you one thing this is built well it weighs a ton one two three four five six Get the glass back on we'll do one more here Last slides on, rest in. Lock her on up. So you need to figure it out at home yet. And insert your back. are working but I am not. Cheesy Wiz, Wildcat, what are up guys? Thanks for tuning in. Happy Alien Day. Shot that straight to the out lane. All right. There is our face hugger. And 
Let's see where we hope for. Pop it into the chest buster. That was a virtual ball save that was on purpose. If you're wondering, that is a code error where it accidentally sometimes gives you two balls. Debbie Pie, thanks for hosting me. I just started a mode because ball three and we've done almost nothing. This is combat drop. Shoot the blue stand up targets to load the ship. Shoot the ramps to land the ship. Seriously, the last one. something else. Shot. 
A multi ball start. Oh no, it didn't. Let's do this mission then. That thing's gonna eat through the goddamn hall. Come on! So I think what's happening is whatever's wrong with my LEDs is also affecting that left side over there. Because the saucer is lit for the multi ball. Oh, I'm shooting for blue here. Sorry, I'm shooting for blue. Got my modes mixed up. That's a life cycle completed. Into a drain. Mother fudger.
starting. Oh no! Oh man, I thought that was starting ambush. That is not good. Okay, there's our face hugger. this to feed our upper flipper so we can do that. Boom! Tunnels are cleared. We have to be close to an ambush multi ball I would think. No! Ooh. That was hell of lucky. That was not. Mother fudger. Uh, tradition never dies. As much as anything is a long-term keeper game for me. Uh, really hard to say. Who knows. I'm really enjoying it right now. Uh, definitely want to see what the code updates do. But there's definitely some little issues like a couple of lights that just went out between two games here. Came back on with a power up. Put them back in test and just double check again. Yeah, you can see my left ramp, left orbit, and none of my bonus lights are working. They're all kind of in the middle of the game. But let's see what happens if we do a power down and a power up. But yeah, uh, so far, really liking it. A lot of fun. Uh, lodging Dolphin, yes, this is mine. Uh, I picked it up at Texas Pinball Festival. And it took me a little while to get it home because I flew uh, to and from Texas. So I, uh, I didn't have it here right away. Oh, and you can see there's something off the screens there on the power up. That happens very rarely. But let me do another quick reset. Probably powered it on a little too quickly there. It runs on a computer, so everything you can have going on with a computer, you know, that sort of thing can happen here too. Uh, but overall, so far, very happy with it. It's a ton of fun. Seems to have a lot of stuff to do in it. The modes are all different and unique. Uh, no, they actually just today released a video of the LE art package. Uh, shortly before I went live with the stream. I haven't even seen it completely yet myself. I saw a quick little screen grab of it, and that is it. Alright, so my lamps are still out here, so... Oh! Nope, there they go. And they're all back now. Well, it's gotta be a connector, because it seemed like shaking it a bit, kind of... Yep, there they went. There they're on. And there they're off. There they're on, there they're off. So I gotta have a loose connector somewhere in there. Uh, thanks man, it's been fun. I've streamed it a couple times here. Uh, I was gonna stop 45 minutes ago and I'm still going. So we will call it uh, quits for right now. Thank you everyone who tuned in. Uh, I'll be back again, possibly tomorrow night. I got uh, some friends coming over. So there may not be much chat going on, much talking, but it's uh, a friend of mine. He just turned eight. It's his birthday. He, his name's Davin. He had autism. Not had. He has autism. Uh, but he's coming over tomorrow night to celebrate his birthday, have a little pizza, play a little pinball. So we're probably going to turn on the camera and stream. I think he might think it's cool. So anyway, tune in for that tomorrow night. Uh, otherwise, I send you out on this little uh, lamp test thing here. And all the lamps, of course, are working again now. But shake it. Seems solid. I don't know. It's an early type game. What can I tell you? Happy. We'll see it again here. Uh, you guys have any questions before I uh, totally get out of here? It's almost 9 o'clock. Wow. I didn't realize how late it was.
see you, Cheesy Wiz. I was rocking my uh, Pindigo shirt last night, actually, down at League. Thank you. Interesting. Oh, perfect timing. There goes a light. Coin one and two. That was active. Uh, when am I going to sell you Genesis? Well, I got a buddy who uh, recently acquired a second Genesis. Somebody's already trying to buy it from him. If uh, he doesn't take it, I'll pass along the information to you, man. Uh, I'll let you know. Robert, thanks again. Uh, I pop popped up the uh, flyer for Main Street Mayhem with your guys' awesome artwork. Thank you again for that. I greatly appreciate it. Uh, getting pumped for that tournament. Seems like we got a lot of interest. I think we'll fill it up pretty quickly with the 48, and we'll get that shirt order into you as soon as I can, my man. Thank you again for all that help with the tournament. Appreciate it. All right, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, we will be back tomorrow evening with some probably not super good gameplay, uh, but it, it should be fun nonetheless. And uh, just before we go, just going to show off that Genesis for Robert here. Sorry, messing up the whole camera rig. A little shadow and a little Genesis right next to it, man. So, one of these days, it may be yours. Hopefully, I didn't mess up my camera. Whoop, too far. Just about right. There we go. And we gotta figure it out. Alright, later, guys.